My name is Adrian Owen. I work at the MRC Cognition and Brain Sciences Unit in Cambridge in the United Kingdom. Um, my area of research involves patients who have what we call disorders of consciousness. These are things like vegetative state and coma and the minimally conscious state. We try and work out what's going on uh, in the minds of these patients using uh, different types of functional neuroimaging. One of the big questions in the field right now is just how many uh, of the patients that appear to be vegetated, so appear to make no responses when they're prompted with stimuli in the outside world, might actually have residual cognitive function. They may actually be able to think and perhaps even mem remember and, and know where they are and these sorts of things. So we're interested in trying to work out um, what proportion of patients may actually be conscious despite appearing to be vegetative. The second important question is whether we can uh, come up with means for them to actually communicate and this is where things like EEG or, or techniques like fMRI might really come into their own. We may be able to find ways of using those techniques to actually communicate and to allow some of these patients to communicate with the outside world. Um, what I find interesting about this research is it, it tells us um, quite a lot about normal conscious experiences. So for example, by studying patients who have disorders of consciousness, we can learn quite a lot about consciousness itself. Um, we perform investigations in healthy volunteers who are sedated using the sorts of drugs that they used uh, to, to perform a general anesthesia. And this can, again, not only tell us about how it might be to be a patient that has a disorder of consciousness, but also um, the effects of different levels of consciousness on normal cognitive function.